This is Johan Gamble. We're back playing Shimigami Tensei Nocturne. Last time we made it to Yogi Park. Um, apparently a lot of power is being drawn here by an item, and we don't want all that power to go into the wrong hands, so we're gonna take it for ourselves. Not that we can use it, because we're hu we're not human and we don't have a reason, but we can at least keep it from others. Um, I did actually quite a bit of training off screen. I think I was like, what, level 59 last time? I'm 62, so I did quite a bit. Um, I got a new move. I got rid of, um, one of my attacks for Deathbound. I forgot which one it was, but Deathbound is a lot better. Um, and so I did quite a bit of leveling up. I'm, I got some new characters. I got this guy. He's pretty good. He's really good magic. Um, I think he's the fusion with my Starman and somebody else. Uh, Starman and, um, Phantom. And then I got, I still got him. But then I, I also was able to... Uh, recruit a Titania, Titania, who's very good. She has some really good magic, um, what, especially when she uh, she actually learns prayer. So I definitely want her to get that. But that's the last move she learns. So we're holding on to her. And then I uh, got him. But then I also got her husband, and he actually learns some really good magic too. So he's, w I'm keeping them kind of in the party. And right now I'm trying to just guess get this, which is life. I think life aid gives you more HP, which would be good. Um, so anyways, let's go ahead and start. This place is pretty annoying because, um, yeah, you'll get teleported if you go through the wrong way. Thankfully, though, they mark it on your map because I'm probably going to go the wrong way a lot. This game, there we go. I'm going to go the wrong way a lot, probably. Okay, so yeah, you can actually see where the pixies are if you go to the top of the section. Um, so that way you don't have to go back. And kind of keep a, a yeah so you can tell by the color so yeah the green is the so let's see we need to go farther out this way but let us take a look so it looks like that door so i'm gonna have to go all the way around to the f all the way to the back way good to know okay so let's go ahead and head over there then yeah the boss of this area actually there's gonna be two bosses the boss of this area and then the next candelabra which i think we can do now i think it's the last candelabra we need and then we can actually go ahead and head to the next kalpa mm, yeah i don't i don't know if i really want to hang out with him he cuts people's faces off and i'm not super into that even though my friend now does it. Ooh, that does not look safe this is pretty this is not look there's there's only one barrier, but there's not a barrier here. There needs to be more. Oh, man. Yeah, trust me. Where I work, they would definitely be all over that, where there's not enough barriers. And I don't even have PPE, first of all. I shouldn't even be allowed here. I don't have any person. I don't even have any safety equipment on. So I'm definitely a no-go here. Okay, this place isn't that hard once you know. I actually forgot that you can see where the fairies are by going to the top of the tower. If you do that, it's way easier. Okay, yeah. So, Titania, of course, is, um, I believe she is from the story of Midsummer Night's Stream, and she is the queen. So, yeah, she's the queen from the Midsummer Night's Stream. Yep. Okay, this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Okay, so just two ogres. Anyways, this place is really good for grinding, but it's also really good for money. The only thing that sucks is, though, Titania will confuse you, and you'll throw a shit ton of money away. I threw thousands of... of My character threw thousands of dollars away. Just... Well, actually, one, two, one, ten, hundred, thousand, ten, hundred, hundred. He's, th he's throwing, like, a hundred thousand. Yeah, was it ten? Yeah, he's throwing, like, ten thousands. He's throwing so much money away. Not ten thousand, but he, he threw away at one point a... Th uh, 9,000. I was so pissed off. And it was been, and it's been a couple levels since I I actually got, you know, like two levels off and I, and I didn't save since then. I was like, I don't want to redo it all. So it was like it was I don't think it was 9,000, but it was de it was more than 4,000. I remember that and I was kind of pissed off. Unfortunately, though, we didn't see we haven't gone to a tower yet, so we don't know which one of these things will teleport us. So let's just go straight for that. Not that it matters too much. We have a, um, we have a, we have the map which will tell us. Well, shoot, it doesn't look really look like I get a choice because I got to get through here. Okay, that's safe. And unfortunately, you can't really see it. Um, now where is the tower from here? Where is the, where is the cat? Where is the catwalk? Is that it over there? Mm, shit. 
shoot, I'm not really sure where I'm going right now. This place is confusing. I'm probably gonna run. Yep. Okay, there we go. I want to get to that area, I think, right there. And, oh boy, they put us really far away. I have no idea. Oh. Get lost. Come on, I can totally just kill these things. Oh, hold on. Oh, they put it right next to us. Thank you. That's pretty helpful. The only thing that sucks now, though, is... Even though I'll be able to see them trying to get oriented and trying to remember where where what's what is kind of hard. Okay, so our goal is over there. So let's see, how are we going to get over there? Okay, so it looks like if we go down, let me see. Yeah, so if we go down, we can go through there, go through there, go, go through there, go up, do, 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 go do, 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 do. Okay, I think I know the way. Jeez, it's gonna be kind of... Wait a minute, one more time. One more time. Let me just double check. I know what I need to do. So let's see. We're gonna want to hit that door. Go up, 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 up. And just go straight through the middle. Go left and hit the first corner. Okay. Got it. That should be how we do this. So yeah, this place isn't that hard. I, for, I actually really did forget, though, that you can look at the... um. Oh, shoot. Can I not? Oh, it doesn't let me go that way, does it? There's no way to go around, huh? Yep, okay, I gotta go this way then. Well, I should be able to be- I should be okay. Okay, so I believe it was this one that was safe. Yes, okay. We're on track. Okay, here we go, Titania. Titanias are resistant to magic and they love to use, um, that move. So very dangerous. But here's Deathbound. As you can see, crazy powerful. Takes a lot of HP though. But man, is it strong. Very large critical hit rate too, I think. So it's pretty damn good. And yeah, look, just from those, from it was mostly the Titanias that gave me all that experience, but yeah. Dynas is on health standby. See, like I was saying before though, the bosses that were, okay, so shoot, let me think. I think we just wanted to go straight. Yes, okay, we've been here before. Um, the boss, the, the next boss that we fight is actually kind of hard because uh, my character is nothing but a physical character. And unfortunately, that doesn't work really great with the boss because he's immune to physical attacks. Okay, now this area I remember is annoying because they like to bring in the high pixies. And unlike the regular pixies, the high pixies will actually move. They do not stay consistent in their placing. So it becomes very annoying if I remember that's how they work. So first though, we're going to try and get to the... Oh, there's a save point. I will just save real quick. Alright. We're actually making pretty good time, which is nice. Okay. So let's head up here again. Now, I'm pretty sure the high pixies do like the move, so... But I think they show you when they move, though. So let's see. Yes, they change positions. So they'll change though once you go underneath um, one of them, I believe. So let's see. So let's see. Our destination is bada 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 bada, all the way over there. Okay, so let's see. So it looks like the only way we can go. No, we can go. It looks like. No, we. Looks like we can't go this way. That way's blocked. And is okay. There's a door right here. So we're gonna go this one and then to make it over there we're going to want to go under i'm thinking we're going to want to go straight under this one and depending on how let's see no if we go straight but uh, yeah no we don't really have much of a choice we got to go straight under this one and then okay and then we'll see where the pixies move because depending on their movements we have to maybe change up our plan so we will see yeah I remember, I, thought that, I remember this place being harder, but I'm also way better at this game than I was when I first played through it. Yeah, so we moved, but unfortunately though, I don't think we get to see where they move. Which kind of sucks. Um, this way was blocked before, I believe, so let's go this way. Okay. Nope. Alright. And damn, they put us really far. Yes, they're very annoying. Yeah, there's a cross and an X. Oh, I see. Okay. So we can see what the four... We can tell what they're doing by the formation that they take. 
All right, cross and X. Well, unfortunately, I don't know what either one really looks like. Okay, the X formation, okay. Um, let's not go that way. Um, our exit is over there. So let's see. We want to go this way, I believe. Nope, not safe. Oh, was safe. Okay, good. Yeah, so th this this part I don't like. The other part is fine because um, you can... Um, you know where they are. They stay consistent. But this one they don't. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, no, that just puts us right back here, though. I just went in a circle. Damn it. So, yeah, okay. And then they're back there. Jeez. Yeah, I'm not a super big fan of this one. I feel like at this point you kind of just got to guess it. Okay, now that I've gone that, they sh he should be moved. It shouldn't be here anymore. Okay, so he's not there. So, the last time I went straight up. That one was a no-go. So let's go here. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. I think I had it right earlier, but I just messed up. So yeah, we go through this way. Switch formations. And then we go through here. Because... Bam, I think. No, that just... I just went in a complete circle. That's it. That didn't do anything. Unless I need to go down there, but I don't think I need to go down there. Yeah, I don't think I need th I really hate this puzzle. Okay, but there's one that- Oh, okay, hold on. There's one over this way. Okay, I got it. I made this harder than it needed to be. You go this way. And then you go around. And then there's a door right here. Yeah, I actually made that harder than it needed to be. I was- Yep, and then look, it's clear. I don't know why I was having such a hard time with that. You know, sometimes you just have a brain fart. And I think those were one of those moments for me. Um, you know, it happens occasionally, you know. Yep, okay. And that should be it. We should be good. That should be a clear shot. And I think that's about... I'm not sure. I think that's... I think we're almost done with this area. Hopefully we are. I don't remember how long this area is completely. What you gotta say? Mm, all right. I really don't want to deal with him. Oh, okay, now we can't even use. Okay, this is the last one. Damn. Ah. <sighs> Great. Yep, so they got the... They trashed... Crashed the, the tower for us, so we can't go in... So we can't do that, which is a bummer. Mm. Yep, so we have no way of knowing how we need to get around. Okay, anyways, let's see. It's what's in here. I don't know where this takes us. It's better than up. Okay. Yes, I will unlock it. Oh, hey, takes us all the way over here to the other side of the garden. Wow, isn't that crazy? Um, I think I'm okay, though. I don't need to heal, but that's... I forgot about that. All right. So now that side's open. Now that I think you'd ever really need it. But I guess if you want to save, if you don't want to risk it... All right. No idea which one I need to go through. Well, let's go to the last one, then. Um... Alright, let's just go across. Nope. Okay, good. It's just regular pixies. Okay. Then this is just fine. Whoa. Okay. She teleported me crazy far. Alright. Fortunately, I don't know where the communication tower really is. It's kind of hard to tell. Okay, let's just keep going straight and see what happens. Well, that's... Yeah, well, might as well. 
Okay, nothing. Yeah, thankfully, though, they're not warping around. Yeah, this place is pretty damn good for experience. Man. Let's see. Okay, we don't want to go straight, so let's go this way. All right. Then let's go this way. Again, this is way easier just because the fairies can't warp you. Uh, they, they, I mean, they warp you, but they don't, you know... They don't uh, constantly keep moving, which is where the difficulty lies. The warps are annoying, but once you have it on the map about where you can't go, it's not that bad. Let's see what may... Nope, won't even let me go that way. Okay, so this place is kind of just a dead end. Alright, so turn around. Yep, okay, so we'll go this way. We'll go left. Up. Um, okay, well, let's put that back on. I need to do something with this guy. I've had him forever. And he's only level 26? Jeez. Okay, let's go straight. Watchful really doesn't give you that much experience. Oh, and we're done. There we go. That's it, I believe. Yeah, we don't want to go in there quite yet. I think that's... Definitely where we're... I think that is the t communication tower. Yeah, that looks like the big place. So let's hold off on that. We want to find some save points. Pretty sure there's places we can save. Pretty sure that's where we want to go. But let's explore a little bit. Bead. Breed. Alright, level up. Oh, you leveled up too, I guess. Um, I'll get rid of stun needles. Nice, he's gonna learn. He's gonna learn uh, an almighty spell soon. Uh, I think it's a medium almighty spell, so that's pretty damn decent. All right, new. Do your magic. Bring our boy back. All right, now you do your magic, Obron, and heal. And I will, yeah, I'll bring, I'll bring you. Um, okay, hopefully what this does is this gives us a save, because uh, I don't know what the likelihood of me beating this boss on the first time is. Like I said, it's a tricky boss. Okay, good, there's a save. But it's a small terminal. I guess that's why they let you leave to go on the other side. But it's okay, the character, the, the, uh... Uh, let me see. I think I'll be okay with these guys. Yeah, these guys I think will be okay. The ones I have right now. Let me see if I can give you that because you're definitely going to need it for your stuff. Okay. All right. I'm going to save quick. And I say let's go do the boss in this part because we got more stuff to do in the next part. So let's, let's deal with the boss here. So we can commit to the... I'm not looking forward to the next... Uh, Candelabra. I remember that candelabra being kind of annoying. So we'll see. Actually, one thing I might do. I might just for a second summon you. Oh, wait, a minute, you're level 20, 41. Okay, I was looking at someone else. I'm going to have him in the party just for a second because we can, you know, use his ability to run away from anybody who tries to fight us. Okay. And now we'll return you back, and then we'll resummon. Oh, see, you could be really good here. You might be, but you have such weak physical. I... We'll bring you. We'll see. We'll see how this turns out. And actually, one thing is, I probably want. I don't know what's the best Magatama to have for him. I don't. Rem... I think he mainly just uses physical stuff. Okay, um, I don't remember exactly what he uses. I don't remember if he uses, uh, magic. So we'll just use, we'll just keep this one on just because, you know, just in case he likes to, well, hold on. My main character's not even fully healed. That is a no-go. Okay, you're all out of magic, but let's see. Can anyone else heal? I think every, oh, well, we have items too. I think everyone's fully healed. Okay, let's go ahead. Let's do this, yeah. Oh boy.
It would make a pretty cool coat. Kind of funny how they give him a cutesy sound with his eyes. Um, anyways, though, yeah, this guy's a pain in the ass. Um, so I'm just gonna go ahead and just do this. I think he can actually get rid of his, um, I think he can actually get rid of the weaknesses. I mean, get rid of any debuffs. So, yeah. Um, but I don't know if he can get rid of our buffs. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna debuff him and buff us as much as we can. He... He's immune to all... F he voids physical. So physical is not going to work. And he voids, you know, expel, death, curse, nerve, and mind. Um, okay, so yeah, he can get rid of them. Which is a bit of a bummer. And he can also give us stuff. So he's, you know, he's pretty damn annoying. Um, and like I said, it's kind of a bummer for us because we are so, you know, physically focused. Yeah, but uh, let's do attack mirror. Maybe he'll do some physical attacks. So let's see, you just keep blasting with magic. Um, nope. Now that gets rid of, right, so... Since he's messing with our defense, let's raise our dodge. And then let's go ahead and... You raise our defense. You work on that. Unfortunately, it looks like Titania is the only one that's going to be doing magic right now. She's the only one that's going to be actually fighting. Yeah, see, unfortunately though, even then, it doesn't do anything. In fact, what I might do is I might... Let's actually swap out Titania for a minute. Let's see if this will work out. And let's see. Let's start raising our magic. And then, of course, you just go ahead and raise our dodge and aim. And you go ahead and just raise our defense. So thankfully, though, he can't get rid of it all in one fell swoop, I believe. Okay, yeah, so yeah, the dodges are definitely coming in handy. Um, I'm going to pass with him, because I'm going to wait until we get our magic all the way up. Otherwise, my main character isn't going to be able to do really anything. So again, let's go. That's number three. And this should be number three. So yeah, if you're, if you're prepared, this shouldn't actually be too hard so yeah I think I definitely came prepared and I you know did it okay good I'm glad I did the mind I, I had a feel I felt like I remembered him doing that before but I couldn't remember um yeah it's definitely definitely worth the grinding I did just a little bit because yeah these enemies the bosses start getting kind of ridiculous if you're not prepared or if you don't have a good team set up just think, okay, now let's give up. Let's try Tornado. Let's see how much it does. All right, 186. See, not great, but our character also has shitty magic, so. Thankfully, though. Yeah, he's... Yeah, and he... And that guy voids that, so it's not even a... Yeah, we got this in the bag. I was kind of worried about this fight, but... Uh, looked like I had nothing to worry about. Oh, magic's already done. So this should probably be the last. Oh, no, it's still... Okay. And what about this? Still going, I guess. All right. Well, let's pass that off and actually let him do the attacking, since he does a little more than you. Look at that. Look how much... That's pretty good. Again, though, the only thing is, though, he's pretty physically weak. I think our stats are fine, though. I don't... Yeah, he could survive a Blight. Only taking 86. Okay, Void. Um, let's start going on the offensive now. I think I'll do one more defense up, but then I'm just going to... It's going to be time to start attacking. Unfortunately, the only way he can attack is through meditation, since his other move is a curse. But you, though, you got... You got this bad boy. Oh, yeah. 341. That's what I like to see. And then I'll make you use that move, too. But first, we raise the defense one more time. All right. Now we're at the max. Even though he can get low our defense, too, but he's just not doing that. And he's, wow, he is, yeah, okay. Wow, I remember him being way harder than this, but, uh, 
Again, I just chose a really good... I guess I just did a really good team composition on this one. Yeah, if you have a good team, these things are way easier if you set things up right. And let's see how much this does. Okay, about 500. Nice. Again, the annoyance is though he is immune to physical, so my main character can't really join in um, on doing a ton of damage, especially since I'm almost out of magic. But, you know, he can do a little bit. Um, let's heal, just to be safe. And then, yeah, mainly our, our main attack is just going to be this guy. He's going to be everyone but our main character. Unfortunately, he's almost out of magic, so I might actually give him a something nice. Oh, yeah, that's what I like to see. And the last tornado. I'm actually really happy with this. I think he only has about, like, 4,000 health. I don't remember how exactly how much, but he doesn't have a ton. Boom! Oh, and we won. Wow, that was really easy. Oh, but the fight's not over yet. We had to fight him, but this is going to be super easy because, uh, well, yeah, we get to keep all of our stat buffs. Um, if we didn't, this would be harder, but since we have all of our stat buffs, it's, it's not anything. So let's just preach on him. Oh, he voids that shit. All right, well, let's just blast him with lightning. I don't think he's got a lot of health. Oh, yeah, you got no chance, buddy. Let's give him a little divine shot. Boom. Nice. Give him a little bit of meditation. Oh, yeah, he's looking a little slower now. And I'm thinking this will finish him. Yep, he's done. Don't worry, a lot of guys have lost to me. And that has a lot of experience for... That actually turned out really easy. I'm really happy. Alright, and let's see what Life Aid does. Oh, uh, no. Let's put it... No. Let's put it into... Shoot. Let's put it into more agility for now. And Life Aid... Heals HP moderately after every battle. That's actually kind of useful, but we're not gonna... I don't think we really need that. And I'm a saint. Okay, yeah. Depending on uh, the order you um, master the Magatama, it kind of gives you a different title. And it seems like I've been doing a lot of the holy ones by accident. So, yeah. Oh, Ice Boost. Yes, definitely want you to learn that. Uh, Let's get rid of... That's never really been useful for me. Uh, no, you cannot. Never. I've been burned once too many a times for that. Not happening again. All right, there we go. Eh, but there's no juice in it. I guess he used all of it or most of it to summon that monster. But that was fairly easy. That didn't. And now we can use the big terminal to get the hell out of. Oh. Get the hell out of here. Hmm. Oh, okay. Oh, boy. Well, she did talk about how she had a... How she kind of came to a reason, but she didn't have a god yet, I think. So, maybe she's found her god now. She seemed to have her reason before. But, with no benefactor. Alright, let's just go to the small terminal then, and I think we'll end the video here. We gotta go see our teacher. See what's up with her now that we've gotten this. She said she wanted it, but, okay. So, you know, I'm gonna end the video here, and uh, we'll continue playing more Shimagami Tensei in the next part. So, it's been a game. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Okay, bye then.